guys and welcome to another day of my 12 days of Christmas series my my vlogmas whatever you want to call it um, today we are going to talk about Christmas music because I don't think anything can transport you to the Christmas state of mind quicker than Christmas music um, and for me that is the oldies like super traditional Bing Crosby, Perry Como, Frank Sinatra, Rosemary Clooney, uh, just like that whole era of um, singer-songwriters doing Christmas songs. That just, man, it's just like immediately I get that Christmas feeling, you know, no matter what time of year it is. I will listen to Christmas music any time of the year, it doesn't matter <laughs> when it is. If I need a little pick-me-up or if I'm just kind of feeling down or if I'm just feeling really happy and I want to like get that feeling going throughout my whole body, Christmas music is the way to do it, I think. I love it. Some people hate Christmas music. I am not one of those people. So I will be sharing with you some playlists and some specific songs that just really they're like quintessential Christmas songs for me. So, also, public service announcement. This sweater is so warm and cozy. I got it from Target this year. It's 2019. If you are in need of, like, if you're just always cold, I'm always cold. Work is especially cold. So, this, like, furry, it's just like a furry, a faux fur, like, wool kind of material. But it comes all the way up to my neck. <laughs> Highly recommend it. I will link this below because this sweater is like amazing. Okay, so let's get to the Christmas music. <laughs> I will pop in some pictures here of um, specific songs that I love that are Christmas songs. They're all oldies. Albert and Edie decided that they needed to wrestle on the couch right next to me as soon as I started <laughs> recording. Hopefully that's not too loud and disturbing. Um, let's see. Okay, so yeah, let me just pop in some pictures of some Christmas songs that are like in my very top, top 10 probably. There might even be just 10 songs. Let's see. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Yep. Let's call it my top 10 Christmas songs. <laughs> and they are all oldies, like 50s, 60s time frame. And um, you can find them all in my, I have a Christmas playlist that I've been working on for probably five years or so. They're all old Christmas songs, like mid-century kind of Christmas songs. So. I will link that below in case you want to go check it out. You can follow it. You can just listen to it if you want to. Um, they're so great. There's one song. There's an album called A Crosby Christmas. And there's one song called A Crosby Christmas Medley. And then it lists all the songs. But one of the songs, the lyrics say, Strangers I meet all seem like friends And the world's just a neighborhood In that song, there is a line that goes, And the world's just a neighborhood. And they're talking about how around Christmas time, Everybody seems like they're on the same page, you know, like every Everyone starts decorating they decorate their houses they put Christmas trees up All the stores get on board and they have all the same stuff out like Christmassy stuff They all play Christmas music radio stations play Christmas music. There's Christmas things on television like it's just one of those the only time of the year where everyone unless you don't celebrate Christmas, celebrate Christmas, everyone is on the same page. And it's it's not always true, but I feel like people are just nicer around Christmas time. I don't know. It's just, I feel like that, that line in that song just really wraps up the whole feeling of Christmas and why I love it so much. 
Okay, so my top 10 favorite oldie Christmas songs. <laughs> That's a mouthful. Um, in no particular order, these are just the ones that I listened to recently this year. This was in October because I will listen to Christmas music anytime. Um, so my top 10 list is, um, and I'll, I'll put a picture right here so you can see <laughs> what the album is and all that stuff. So my top favorite songs are Sleigh Ride by Bing Crosby. I'm sure lots of other people sing these songs too, but these are just the artists and the songs that I like the most. Okay, um, next, Mistletoe and Holly by Frank Sinatra. It's so simple and so great. Um, that You Santa Claus is a Louis Armstrong song, and it's so, it's just funny. It's like a fun, quirky Christmas song. A Crosby Christmas Medley um, by Bing Crosby. The Christmas Symphony by Perry Como. I think Perry Como's voice is like, man, it is right up there with Bing Crosby. You can't have Christmas without Bing Crosby and Perry Como. In my opinion, Tony Bennett, his whole album, the Christmas album Snowfall, is perfect. And in my top 10 is the song Christmas Land. But if it starts snowing, you can bet that I start singing Snowfall because, hi baby because it is so good. It is so good. Rosemary Clooney's White Christmas. You know, we usually listen to White Christmas by Bing Crosby, and it's great, but I also really love Rosemary Clooney. <laughs> and then We Need a Little Christmas by Johnny Mathis. I like this song also a little bit more now just because in 2016, when our current administration was uh, voted for and hired, not 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 my choice the day that like the tallies were up or whatever um our local radio station decided to start playing christmas music like three weeks early because we needed a little bit of christmas because of the horrible news of the election so that song is a little bit more special to me now just because i thought that was really awesome that they did that and i totally agreed it did not make the situation better but the Christmas music helped a little bit. Um, next up is Frank Sinatra's Christmas Memories. That's so good. I wish I could play these for you on here, but I don't want to get um, copyright infringements and stuff. And sometimes I do put music in just because I'm, I'm not monetized or anything right now. I mean, I have like 32 subscribers, so I'm not like in danger of not making money from these, but um, I don't know, just in case. Um, next up, Oh, I love this song so much. Um, this song is, I'd like to hitch a ride with Santa Claus. And it's just such a fun, like little kid song, like totally a little kid's top dream, you know, it's, and it's just catchy and it's sweet and I love it. So that's my top 10. <laughs> I also discovered last year that Spotify has a whole list of Christmas like radio stations. So you, it, they're different genres and stuff. And one of the best ones is the Christmas Peaceful Piano. If you need to just like chill out, but you don't want to listen to songs with lyrics in it, you can just flip on one of these channels. The, the Peaceful Piano one is really great and super like relaxing. I started listening to it at work one day and I was like, I can't listen to this, I'm gonna fall asleep. But it's just so good. I highly recommend this playlist. I'll, li I'll link it below as well so you can check it out. Let me know down in the comments what your favorite Christmas songs are. Do you like contemporary? Do you like the oldies like me? Do you only listen to instrumentals? Whatever. Let me know down below. And if you have a favorite song that I didn't list, please let me know what it is. I'd love to listen to it. I'm always looking for new Christmas songs. I thought about this after I uh, turned off my camera and started going back to work. Also let me know what your least favorite Christmas song is. I'm curious what it is. I know a lot of people hate that Mariah Carey song. My least favorite song is Text Me Merry Christmas. <laughs> That's just me. Anyway, comment below favorite Christmas song and least favorite Christmas song. I can't wait to read your comments. <laughs> okay. Thank you so much for watching and 
If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe. There's a little box right here. If you click that box, the little subscription button will pop up. You just click that and once it turns gray, you are subscribed. Totally free to do it. It just helps out my channel so that YouTube knows that I'm making interesting content and then it might push me up the ladder a little bit so I can reach more people and get some more YouTube friends. <laughs> I post every Monday and Thursday. I do baby name videos. I do week vlogs. This month of December I'm doing Vlogmas, so my 12 days of Christmas. And then uh, next year we have a Disney trip coming up, so that will be on my channel. So if any of that stuff sounds interesting, please do subscribe. That would help me out a ton. I really, really appreciate your support. And give this video a thumbs up. <laughs> Thank you so much, guys. And I will see you next time. Merry Christmas.